Alright boys and girls, we are ready for another shape today. On your math paper, it's got 9.3 at the top. We are looking at squares, not squares. If you do not have your math paper out right now, you can just watch me and then you can work on yours when we are finished. Squares, not squares. Right, so if you all were here, we would be doing some sorting together up on the smart board. But I'll just show you some different choices. Is that a square? Yes. It has four sides. They are all exactly the same. It has four corners or four, four vertices. That's the big math word. Not a square. What is that shape? Yes, it is a circle. A circle is not a square. What about this one? No, that's not a square. It has one, two, three, four sides, but two of them are short. One of two of them are long. That is a rectangle. A rectangle is not a square. There's a square. One, two, three, four sides and four corners, all the same. that a square? No. What is that? That is a triangle. There's a square. There's a square. And there's a square. So we know that a square has four sides. They are all exactly the same length. If it has four sides, it also has one, two, three, four edges. It has one, two, three, four corners, four, ver four vertices. Now, boys and girls, since you do not have shapes like that, if you would like to just draw some squares and some things that are not squares, that is fine. Then you're going to lift up that page, turn it and fold it back, and the directions say put an X on all the squares. So you are going to be looking for shapes that are squares, and you are going to X them out. They have to have four sides all exactly the same length. Now they may have turned them to try to trick you. And do not let them trick you with rectangles. Remember they have two long sides, two short sides. I found four squares when I was looking. After you work on that page, you're going to pick it up and flip it over. Then your directions are for you to color all of the squares that you see. So you're going to have to look at all these shapes. And if you see some that are squares, you will color them. I think you're going to find a lot of squares. You're not going to color circles. You're not going to color triangles or rectangles. Only squares. There's a bunch of them, so look carefully so you don't leave any out. finish, I'm going to count to see how many squares I found. I'm also going to double check to make sure I didn't leave any out. That's not a square. That's not a square. That's not. That's not. That's not. All right, so I found one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten squares when I was looking. All right, so you go back and you color all of your squares. Then when you get to the back page, up by the apple, the directions say which shapes are squares. Put an X on them. So X out any squares that you see. I found two. They turned that one and tried to trick me, but I can tell it has one, two, three, four sides, and they're exactly the same length. 
then draw what you know about a square. Okay, I know what square is. One, two, three, four sides, and they're the same length. So it says, tell someone what you know about a square. And I just told you what I know. A square has four sides. They are all the same length. So it also has four corners. All right, boys and girls, go back and work on your math paper about squares for today. Let me know if you need any help.